Hello everyone, Gabriel John Coombs here once again, getting back to Let's Play Silent Hill 2 for the PlayStation 2. In the last video, we entered Pete's Bolarama. Uh, officially, we found out who that little, who our snot-nosed brat's name was, Laura. I kind of spoiled it for you guys, beginning, that was my mistake. Uh, oops. Um, we also heard a bit about Eddie. Now, for those wondering about the strange YouTube title, Bowling and Pizza, well, Bowling for Pete's Bolarama, obviously, and because Maria said, I hate bowling, what do you have against bowling, I have no clue. What Maria has against bowling, I have no clue. Um, and Pizza, because during the cutscene, when James uh, meets up with Eddie again, um... James says to his town's full of monsters, how can you sit there and eat pizza? And it makes me laugh ever since. Yeah, Eddie, how could you sit there and eat pizza? <laughs> anyway, in this video, we're going to finish up West South Vale and head to our next major area. Where it's going to remind us a little bit about a torture area from Silent Hill 1. Yo, for those who know where I'm to, for those who've played the game before, have major experience with it, and know where I'm to, you guys, you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, let's go. Okay, baggage is still here. So let's go up this alley. She went through there. Yeah, like we're fitting through there. Is there any other way? Yeah, there is. Right through there. Get out of the way, baggage. It's no good. It's locked. Alrighty, sorry about that. Sorry about the delay there. Uh, someone's trying to message me. Okay. Uh, someone's still trying to message me. Uh. Anyway, moving on. Out of the way, baggage. So we have to go up here. Uh, this door where it says it looks like the lock is broken, that's actually an exclusive area in the sub-scenario, uh, Born from a Wish. The one I may do after the main playthrough, which I'm doing now. Uh, don't know. Maybe. Anyway, we have to go through this door. And we are now in Heaven's Night. A nice, lovely bar. With a stripper pole? Okay. That's odd. We have a first aid kit. Anything else in here? Ah, uh, it don't look like it. Nope, besides the exit door. So let's go. And officially, we are on the other end of, uh... The building now. This is why we need to go through Heaven's Night because there's a big barrier here. So we couldn't go down the road. So, uh, I guess we have to go down the road here and see where it leads us. We're nearing the end of this video. And. The thing started glitching again. Don't know if Hypercam spotted it or not. Over there! A plus sign? Oh, no! No! 
That's not good at all. Whenever we see a plus sign, that's definitely not good. Plus signs are definitely not good. Plus, li plus signs are not a good thing. Yes, plus signs are never a good thing. Hospital office. Oh no. Who remembers the hospital from Silent Hill 1? Uh, yeah, right. Well, this is kind of like the hospital from Silent Hill 1, only... It doesn't have the parasitized doctors or the puppet nurses from the first game. This is not Alcamilla Hospital. This is Brookhaven Hospital. Our next major area. So, that's it for this video. I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. And in the next video, well, in the next video, we're going to start exploring Brookhaven Hospital. So, un until then, this is Gabriel John Coombs saying, Adios, amigos.